In this video, we're going to take a look at 11 unusual signs that might suggest your heart isn't in the best shape. It's really important to be aware of these signs so you can do something about it before the situation gets worse. A lot of people think that when something's wrong with their heart, they'll definitely know because the symptoms will be really obvious. However, this isn't always true. Sometimes, things like hidden inflammation, stress that you don't notice, or even not taking good care of your teeth can hurt your heart without you realizing it. Some people also believe that heart problems are something only older people or people who don't live a healthy lifestyle need to worry about. But that's not accurate. Even things like having trouble sleeping because of sleep apnea, feeling stressed all the time, and not keeping your teeth clean can be bad for your heart. And there are more things like this that can affect your heart health. If you're curious about these less obvious signs of heart issues and want to know what they are, make sure to watch this video until the end. We're not just going to talk about these signs, we'll also share some easy ways to live healthier and some medical steps you can take to make your heart stronger and prevent more damage. 1. Calf Swelling or Pain When your calf swells up or feels painful, it could be a warning sign that something is not right with the blood flow in your legs, a condition called peripheral artery disease. This happens when the arteries in your legs, which carry blood from your heart to your legs, become narrow or get blocked. This blockage or narrowing can lead to less blood getting to your legs. Peripheral artery disease is a serious condition because it can also mean there's a higher chance of heart damage or other heart problems. The reason it's so linked to heart health is that the same process causing the blockage in your legs, typically something called atherosclerosis, where a kind of fatty substance called plaque builds up inside your arteries, can happen in other parts of your body too, including the arteries to your heart. If you find that your calves hurt or swell, especially if it happens more after you've been walking or going upstairs, take it as an important signal from your body. This early warning could help prevent more serious health issues, so it's key to act on it. Taking steps like exercising regularly, eating a diet that's good for your heart, and stopping smoking can all help fight against PAD and keep your heart healthier. It's also crucial to talk to a doctor if you notice these symptoms. They can check if PAD is the issue and help guide you on what to do next. Paying attention to these signs early and making changes where needed could significantly impact your heart health and overall well-being. 2. Gums bleeding Gums bleeding easily might seem like a small problem at first. However, it can be an early warning sign of more serious health issues, such as heart disease or gum disease, also known as periodontitis. There's a connection between the health of your gums and your heart. The reason behind this is inflammation. When you have persistent gum disease, it causes your gums to swell and bleed. This inflammation doesn't just stay in your mouth, it can affect your whole body. Experts believe that this inflammatory response can make you more likely to develop heart disease. The way it works is like this. The bacteria that cause your gums to be inflamed and bleed can get into your bloodstream. Once there, they can travel to other parts of your body, including your heart. When these bacteria reach your heart, they can contribute to the buildup of plaque in your arteries. Plaque in your arteries can lead to serious heart problems. Taking care of your teeth and gums does more than just keep your smile bright and prevent cavities. It's also a vital part of keeping your heart healthy. Regular dental checkups, practicing good oral hygiene, and paying attention to any signs of gum disease right away are important steps to prevent these problems. By looking after your oral health, you're not just protecting your teeth, you're taking care of your heart too. Three. Snoring or sleep apnea. We're going to talk about conditions related to sleeping, particularly snoring and sleep apnea, which are often thought of as small problems, but can actually be signs of bigger heart health issues. Sleep apnea is when someone stops breathing for short periods or takes very shallow breaths while sleeping. This problem is more than just loud snoring. It is a serious issue that messes up your sleep routine and decreases the amount of oxygen getting to your body. This lack of oxygen puts a lot of pressure on your heart. People with sleep apnea often have high blood pressure, irregular heartbeats, and face a greater chance of developing heart diseases and having a stroke. If you or someone close to you snores heavily or stops breathing for short times during sleep, it's very important to see a doctor. Getting the right diagnosis and treatment is key. The treatment could involve making changes to how you live, using devices like CPAP machines, which help you breathe easier while you sleep, or other types of health. Taking sleep apnea seriously and getting it treated 
can play a big role in looking after your heart. 4. Extreme Weakness Suddenly feeling extremely weak can be a serious and worrying sign. It's not just about feeling a bit tired. It's about experiencing a deep, overpowering sense of tiredness that comes on quickly and without any clear reason. This is normal. This kind of weakness is a way for your body to tell you something might be wrong with your heart. When your heart doesn't pump blood as well as it should, your muscles and organs don't get the oxygen and nutrients they need, making you feel very tired and weak. This symptom is especially important to pay attention to if you also have other signs that might mean you are having a heart attack. These can include pain in your chest or feeling short of breath. If you suddenly feel this extreme weakness, especially if it's out of the blue and you can't explain it, it's important to get medical help right away. Going to the doctor or the hospital as soon as you notice these signs could very well save your life. 5. Irregular skin rashes or unusual spots Sometimes, skin issues like rashes or odd spots can be more than just skin-deep problems. They might actually hint at something more serious, like heart disease. Certain skin conditions, such as psoriasis or eczema, are not just itchy and annoying. They're tied to a greater chance of having heart problems. This connection mostly comes down to inflammation, a common link between these skin conditions and heart issues. Inflammation plays a big part in atherosclerosis, which is when your arteries get hard and narrow. This condition can lead to heart attacks because it makes it hard for blood to get through. Also, if you notice certain rashes or spots on your skin, it could be a sign of poor blood circulation, another red flag for heart disease. That's why it's really important to keep an eye on any strange or persistent changes in your skin. It could be your body's way of telling you that something's not right with your heart. If you notice anything unusual about your skin, don't brush it off. It's a good idea to talk to a healthcare professional about it. They can help figure out what's causing the skin issue and if it's related to your heart health. Getting to the bottom of these signs early can make a big difference in managing and treating potential heart problems. 6. Nausea or indigestion When you feel sick to your stomach or have a feeling similar to when you've eaten something bad, it's easy to think that it's just a small digestive issue. However, it's very important to understand that these feelings of nausea or indigestion could actually be signs of something much more serious, like heart disease. Sometimes when someone is having a heart attack, they might feel like they are just having severe indigestion, nausea, or stomach pain. What makes this different from regular stomach issues is that taking antacids or other usual stomach medicines doesn't help relieve the discomfort. These symptoms happen because, during a heart attack, the heart has a hard time sending blood that's rich in oxygen to parts of the body, including the digestive system. This is why you might feel these stomach-related symptoms. If these feelings are happening along with other symptoms that are known to be warning signs of a heart attack, such as discomfort or a squeezing feeling in your chest, or if you find it hard to breathe, it's a big red signal that you shouldn't ignore. It's very important to take action and seek help from a doctor or go to a hospital right away if you notice these symptoms, especially if they happen together. Getting immediate medical help is essential to deal with any heart-related problems that could be causing these symptoms. Recognizing these signs early and getting the right treatment can make a big difference in dealing with heart issues effectively. 7. Persistent hoarseness Sometimes, a change in your voice to a raspy or hoarse, one can be a surprising sign that your heart might not be working as well as it should. This happens because when the heart isn't able to pump blood properly, fluid can build up in the lungs. This buildup can then affect your voice box or make you cough a lot, which changes how your voice sounds. A lot of people might not think their hoarse voice is a big deal, especially if they don't have other more common heart trouble signs. However, this change in your voice could mean that your heart is having a hard time doing its job. If you find that your voice has been hoarse for a while, and you can't point out an obvious reason like a cold or allergies, and you're also feeling out of breath or unusually tired, it's really important to talk to a doctor or another healthcare worker about it. Finding out early if something is wrong with your heart and starting treatment can make a big difference in staying healthy and feeling good in the long run. 8. Loss of Consciousness Losing consciousness or suddenly feeling so weak that you pass out, which is known as fainting or syncope, can be a strong warning sign of heart trouble. When someone faints, it means their brain has stopped getting enough blood for a short time. In terms of heart health, this might happen because the heartbeat is off rhythm or there are blockages stopping the blood from flowing as it should. 
It's especially worrisome if someone faints all of a sudden without any warning signs. While there can be many different reasons why someone faints if it happens often or is accompanied by chest pain or trouble breathing, it's very important to see a doctor right away. This is because these symptoms could indicate a serious problem with the heart. Getting checked out quickly by a healthcare professional is key. They can figure out if the fainting is linked to a heart condition. Taking action early is crucial to avoid more serious heart-related problems in the future. 9. Sudden or Excessive Sweating Sweating a lot all of a sudden, or sweating more than usual, can actually be a warning sign that something might be wrong with your heart. This is especially true if you start sweating a lot when you haven't been moving around much or doing anything that would normally make you sweat. This kind of sweating could mean that your heart is having a tough time working the way it should. When your heart is struggling, your body gets stressed and starts to sweat as a response. Often, this unexpected sweating comes with other warning signs that there might be a problem with your heart. You might feel pain or a kind of heavy pressure in your chest, or you might find it hard to breathe. It's really important to pay attention to this kind of sweating and not just think it's because of the weather or something you ate. If you suddenly start sweating for no clear reason, especially if it's a lot, and you also have other symptoms like chest pain or trouble breathing, it's a good idea to get help right away. This could be your body's way of telling you that your heart needs medical attention immediately, and getting that help quickly could save your life. 10. Unusual or prolonged anxiety. When a person experiences unusual or lasts for a long time, it's not only a concern for their mental health, but can also indicate a possible heart problem. Anxiety doesn't just affect your mind. It can have physical effects too, making your heart beat faster and raising your blood pressure. Sometimes, this type of anxiety might be a clue that there's something wrong with your heart, especially if it starts suddenly, is very intense, or comes with other worrying signs like chest pain or difficulty breathing. Anxiety can have many different causes, so it's important not to ignore it, particularly if it's a new feeling for you or has gotten much worse recently. It's a good idea to talk to doctors or healthcare professionals about how you're feeling. They can help figure out if your anxiety is more related to your mental health or if it's a symptom of a physical health problem like heart disease. Getting help from doctors can make sure your heart and overall health are taken care of. 11. Decrease tolerance for exercise. Being able to do less exercise than usual is an important sign you shouldn't ignore because it could mean there's damage to your heart. If suddenly you find it hard to do physical activities that used to be easy, if you feel really tired during or after a workout, or if you have trouble breathing or feel pain in your chest while exercising, these could all be signs of a problem with your heart's health. This usually happens because your heart isn't pumping blood and oxygen to your muscles, as well as it should. The reason might be heart disease or blockages in the arteries that carry blood around your body. If you notice that you're struggling more with your workouts or any physical activity, it's very important to talk to a doctor or another medical professional about it. Catching and treating any heart issues early can make a big difference in managing them effectively. Understanding that we've seen signs of possible heart damage, let's shift our focus to essential steps to better our heart health and lessen further harm. It's important to know it's never too late to start these changes. Even small steps can lead to significant improvements in your heart's health. First, think about what you eat. Cutting down on foods high in saturated fats, trans fats, and cholesterol is key. Instead, eat plenty of whole grains, fruits, vegetables, and fatty fish, like salmon or mackerel, which are full of omega-3 fatty acids, good for the heart. Watching how much salt and sugar you consume is also important. To help control blood pressure, and avoid gaining too much weight or developing diabetes, conditions that can put extra strain on your heart. Being active is just as important. Try to get at least 150 minutes of moderate exercise or 75 minutes of something more vigorous each week. Exercise helps you keep a healthy weight, reduces stress, and makes your heart muscle stronger. It's also crucial to keep an eye on your blood pressure, cholesterol levels, and blood sugar. Regular checkups and following your doctor's advice can help manage these, lowering your risk of heart disease. Smoking and drinking too much alcohol can severely affect your heart. Quitting smoking and drinking less alcohol can greatly lower your chances of developing coronary heart disease and other health issues. Managing stress through mindfulness, meditation, or yoga can also benefit your heart. Long-term stress can lead to unhealthy behaviors that increase the risk of heart disease. 
Finding healthy ways to deal with stress can not only help your heart but improve how you feel.